<laughs> Get the 705 ready. Yeah. <laughs> Hold it. Half man, half woman. It's Gary. I wanna hip you to the T. It's Gary, baby. Five minutes after an hour. This segment is being brought to you by Optima Tax Relief. That's right, Optima Tax Relief. Stop living in fear of the IRS and stop lying to work worried about the IRS garnishing your wages and freezing your bank account. You need to call Optima Tax Relief right now at 800 829 3181. That's 800 829 3181. Optima Tax Relief. Gary, good morning. Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, America. Good morning to you. It's Monday, a beautiful, beautiful day in the neighborhood. And here's what's happening in celebrity news, y'all. Beyonce. They're saying y'all that Beyonce is under fire, y'all, for showing too much booty in Vogue pics. Now, there is being reported, y'all, that Beyonce is on the cover of the December issue of Vogue magazine. And they're saying, y'all, those pictures are drumming up a lot of controversy. Now, they're saying, first, the good news is fans, honey, all over the globe think that Beyonce looked amazing in the pictures. And they're yep. saying, y'all, unanimously agree that the 39-year-old superstar looked gorgeous in the pics and her body was flawless. Mm. But they're saying the bad news is some fans think that those pictures are entirely too sexy, especially for a mother of three. Now, they're worried, y'all, that they may, um, that the fashion magazine over-sexualized her as a black woman. And they're saying, y'all, that this is um, something that's done with social and political ramifications. Now, I saw the pictures of the magazine. Now, one of the pictures that people are talking about, they're showing Beyonce, honey, in a beautiful red dress, but they have a chain, like, dripping down the middle of her butt. That's on the cover, and that's not a good look. Then they got one. That's a good look. It's a great look. It's a good look to me. Yeah, that's her job. But then they got another picture of her lifting one of her legs, honey, and spreading her legs. That is horrible. That is very strumpet effect. Then they got another one in a a silver dress, honey. It's just not a good look for this woman to have three children, Ricky. Y'all, I'm sorry. Those kids are going to grow up to be an adult, and they're going to see their mom and have pictures taken like that, and that's just not a good look. You know, all us got pictures of our grandmama doing all these type of things Mm -hmm. Polaroid pictures. Of your grandmama doing a Chinese <laughs> split at the club. Come on now. Uh, How you think you got a, here? Mm-hmm. Everybody, mama it is went art, Gary. It is art. art, and she is beautiful. Let her be. Stop that's hating. Right. Yes, she's beautiful, but that's not art. Art is when you're putting something on a canvas, a paint. No, that's it's art. not. What? That pictures, those, those pictures art. are art. That's classic. Okay. She looks yeah. stunning. Okay, well, keep. Brad, is that art? Yes, it's art. The shake your tail feather video is art. Thank Message. You. Okay, yes. well, yeah, come start? on, you Gary. You talking to you, an you artist, too hard on so people, she knows. Gary. With yeah. um, Lil Suri and Rumi and um, Lil Blue Lily and Blue Ivy get She's grown. a good mother. She not worried Blue about Lily. it. She not doing nothing distasteful. Okay, well, we talking about it, so they talking about it. So, honey, I just feel so bad for them children when they get older. <laughs> you are that. <there. laughs> But nevertheless, honey, we're going to move on. Another celebrity news, y'all. Sierra and Russell Wilson, baby, they're about to launch a fragrance. They're about to launch their individual fragrance, y'all. They're saying that it's supposed to be out on November the 17th. And they're saying the two um, started the process of the fragrance in the thick of quarantine. Now, Sierra said that this was something I can say made us smile. She said it gave us something to laugh about. And she also said that they have several date nights and around the fragrance. And Sierra's fragrance, y'all, listen to this. Her perfume is going to feature pink peppercorn, pony, and sandalwood. And um, Russell's um, cologne is going to have black tea, lavender, and musk, y'all. So, there you have it. I can't wait to get both of them, honey, to see how they really smell. Pink and peppercorn. What, pink peppercorn, baby. That's what she said. And some pony. Ricky, don't you have some ponies at your house, those little flowers you grow? Ponies? Some ponies, hey, yeah. Peonies? Who? Yeah. No. Are you saying peonies never heard of a pony, pony flower? It's pony. P-O-E-N-Y. Pony. That's P-O-E. I'm pretty sure that's not right. Yeah, that definitely ain't that's no pony. That in the hell is damn pony. I know what pony. That's pony. It's two different ponies. It's P-O-N-Y and P-O-N-E-Y. <laughs> no, it ain't, Gary. <laughs> well, you just Google it and then come back. So anyway, it's pink pony. It's um, pony and sandalwood. And it's going to be some black tea. Rick, why are they trying to climb? You sure you ain't spelling phony? <laughs> <laughs> that's P-H-O-N. Gary, you let them know you graduated. Well, tell them what college you graduated from. I graduated from, from oh. Northwood University, honey. If I'm not mistaken, I think I may be the only one on this show with a degree. But anyway, child. Well, how many years did it take you to get it? <laughs> it don't matter how many years I took to get it, but I got 20. it. 20. Uh, so, it took me 20, but I got it. You're not but the only <laughs> one. <laughs> it took me 20 years, baby. <laughs> It don't matter how long it takes. Just get that's, there. That's right, honey. What did Alita Adams say? She don't care how you get there. Just do get it. Get there when you can. There you go. Did, you can right. reach me by caravan. <laughs> 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 so anyway, y'all, 
in my final story, y'all. Damon Dash at 49 years old just announced the news. Y'all, that he and his baby mama just got a new baby, honey. They have a new son now. She said this is going to be the second kid with her, and he has four kids, all um, five kids all together, y'all. But 49 years old having a damn baby, that's too old to be having a baby, that boy. That, no. Yes, it what is, Ricky. 49. The baby going to be 70 when he, he going to be 70 when the baby 20. Yeah, I mean, I mean, that's still 70 and still practically young. Just older. No, it's not, Garrett. Me, Ricky. It that is young. 70 is the Man, look, my mom, my mom, my dad, 71, 72 years old. They run up and down the steps. They go fishing every day. They go jogging. They exercise. They young. They don't look like it. So, I, I mean, but, but to be a dad, a but new they dad have no 70. baby. Yeah, yeah. I mean, hey, man. Yeah, that's a bit much. I mean, you can still, I mean, yeah, stay young. You 50. That fire's still out there. That fire's still out there. Look a little today, y'all. Yeah, strawberry parfait. On the high end, you say strawberry parfait. And on the low end, you just say dark pink. That's your color for the day. I was waiting for that. <laughs> y'all get-